Are you getting excited about everything new that's coming to the Grove Shopping Center in Wesley Chapel? You might be after watching this Neighborhood News online news desk. I'm Susanna Martinez. And I'm Neighborhood News Editor Gary Nager. And Susanna and I will have that update to our last news desk right after this. Hi, I'm Bill Albert, co-owner of Total Air Solutions. We've been in business for 17 years. We're carrier factory authorized dealers. We do service all brands. If you have a problem, give us a call. We have 24-7 service. Whatever the day, whatever the time, we'll be there. In our last news desk about a month or so ago, we gave you an overview of new owner Mark Gold of Mishareem Gold's plans for the Grove Shopping Center in Wesley Chapel, located off Oakley Boulevard, north of State Road 54, along I-75. Since then, however, Gold and his staff have been busy every day signing up new businesses to join either the separate, long, mostly empty existing buildings across from the Grove's major retailers that he now calls The Village, or the not yet under construction container park designated for the space between The Village and Upex Steakhouse. It really is incredible, Susanna, not just the number of businesses that have agreed to join Gold at The Grove, but how quickly all of these businesses have gotten on board. We already told you about Double Branch Artisanal Ales, the craft brewery that recently made a very popular appearance at the second New Tampa Brewfest. Since then, finalized leases have been announced for restaurants such as Burger Brazil, Troublemakers Dueling Piano Bar and Restaurant, a New York-style pizza place, a Brooklyn Bagel Company store, a Cuban restaurant and rum distillery, and a dessert shop that will combine two local favorites. Wesley Chapel resident Jamie Hess hasn't yet announced what the menu will be at Troublemakers, but that is one place that Jana and I will definitely be visiting a lot. The New York style pizza place will be owned by the same owners as Best New York Pizza in the Pine Brook of the Grove Plaza on State Road 54, and the Cuban restaurant and distillery is owned by the same family that is opening Casa Cubana in another Michelin Gold project in Raleigh, North Carolina. And finally, the dessert box will combine the tasty treats from the Ice Dream Shop on State Road 54 in Lutz and the former Seven Layers Italian Bakery that was in the Oak Grove Plaza, also on State Road 54 in Lutz. I also understand that there will be some non-food businesses opening in the village. That's true. Among them will be F45 Team Training, a unique workout facility, and the Kilted Axe, which will feature axe-throwing leagues and beer, but no food. Gold also plans to add miniature golf, beach volleyball, and much more that we'll have to tell you about in a future episode. In the meantime, you should go check out the community market every Saturday at the Grove, as well as the upcoming Santa's Winter Festival. For leasing information, call Karen at area code 407-636-1266. Or for event info, call Mateus at area code 407-534-0810. For Neighborhood News Online, I'm Susanna Martinez. And I'm Gary Nager. Remember to view, like, and share all of our videos on YouTube and Facebook and look for an upcoming contest exclusively for those who subscribe to our Neighborhood News Online YouTube channel.